What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? My name, of course, is Multikills HD, and I just got done with the host migration in here. So um, I'm only going to be showing you guys the second round, and, uh, you know, it's a really, really good round for the connection I had in here. Uh, I actually believe I was playing on YouTube's host in this game, which he has a really good host, but sometimes it has its moments. So that's all I'm going to be mentioning about that for the gameplay in this video. But anyways, I want to talk about a couple things. I want to talk about... The Wii U. Now you may say, why am I going to bring up the Wii U? Because it's already been out, and I wanted to do a couple of console updates in this video. So the Wii U came out a couple months ago. In November 18th, 2012, it came out. Now you guys may say, yeah, it could have been really, really good, and a lot of people want to go buy it. Well, here's something that may shock you. The first week of the Wii U being out, it sold nearly 400,000 Wii U units. Which, 400,000 Wii U consoles is a lot. I gotta give it to that. Well, the Wii U launched in December 2006, sold about 475,000 Wii copies, and emptied the entire stock. So basically, the Wii is pretty much over at this point because all their consoles have a bad reputation. So I think a lot of people are starting to realize that, you know, the Wii U was good for its time period, but anymore, it's just really not up to standards and, you know, specs on the console and you know just for its time now you know it's just really not that great anymore so one more thing i want to talk about in this video guys and that is playstation 4 and next generation xbox to announce prices well a couple people that are very good at estimating prices for video game consoles and have been within 50 dollars every single time have predicted the Xbox and the PlayStation 4 will be four to five hundred dollars range for the most expensive one, being at six hundred. The average console with a decent sized hard drive is going to be four to five hundred dollars, and the smallest Xbox they have is going to be three ninety nine. And the same storage, lowest edition one for the PlayStation 4, is going to be three ninety nine estimated. So I guess what I'm trying to say in this video is. There's a lot of consoles coming out. There's a lot of consoles being developed. There's a lot of new things coming to the scene this year. And some of these things are going to be good. I know it for a fact. And I know for another fact, some of these things are going to be just really not that great. And there's going to be glitches. There's always glitches. And as I say this in this video right now, PlayStation the Network is down right now because they're doing updates because they had another intruder get into the system and they're trying to fix it. So, what I want to say, guys, is E3 in June may be the biggest thing we have seen in years. The updates that they're going to be saying out there, you know, the console news, everything you want to know about the next generation of everything on whether it be YouTube, whether it be consoles, whether it be Anything electronic is going to be there, and you guys want to keep your eyes out and your ears open for these. Because some of these things are going to change how we play Xbox, how we play PlayStation, how we play maybe another console coming out. Anyways, guys, just keep your eyes and ears open, and let's see what happens. Anyways, guys, my name, of course, is Multi Kills HD. If you guys could, hit the like button for me, and I'm out. Peace.